Good morning, good evening, good day, or good afternoon, whatever time of day it is for you. Hi, how are you? So today, I thought we could do a very quick little video where we discuss some new skincare products I've been trying. First and foremost, little disclaimer, I have a family in a small house, and it's a family of like seven people, and they are watching football right now, right in the front room, which is right outside of my room, and it is going to be loud. I am sorry. <laughs> And this is going to be a fairly short video because I only have three skincare products to talk to you guys about. But I wanted to get it out there and I didn't exactly want to do a get ready with me and then just mention it out of the blue. So it's going to be a very small, very quick video talking about it. And that is also because I have lost track of time today. <laughs> I woke up so late and I cleaned, well helped clean the house. I dusted the floors, I mopped the floors, I did the whole bathroom, and I took a shower and I did my whole routine, and then by the time I was done, I had no motivation to do anything. I, it's so cold today. I am wearing a shirt, oh, I got my thumb stuck in there, a shirt under this, sweatpants and fuzzy socks over the little ankle ends of my sweatpants. It's safe to say that um, my cold acclimation from when I was living in Seattle is gone. <laughs> it's not even that cold here, and I can't handle it. But I love the cold weather, so that's okay. Anyways, enough with the little tangent. Let's get into the three skincare products that I have to talk to you guys about today. I thought we'd start with the stuff that I don't like of the three, and then move into the stuff that I do like of the three because I feel like it's always better to end on a good note than to end on a bad one. I'm going to start with something from the brand French Girl. Now I've never heard of this until my dad's wife, Olga, was kind enough to when she heard that I no longer had my hyaluronic acid serum, hand me these products because she didn't use them and let me use them. And you know, I really should have, I should have said no, because if she didn't use them, maybe there was a reason behind it. But I did a test on the inside of my wrist where the skin is very delicate there. I did a test there. I did a test behind my ear and I did a test on my cheek to see if it irritated my eczema at all. And it didn't. And I checked the ingredients. There's nothing I'm allergic to. I was also very worried about this because it is heavily fragranced. Heavily. I mean, my skin can handle light fragrances. This product is so heavily fragranced, it gives me headaches every day. This is the French Girl Serum Lumineux. Serum de Neroli, which is the clarifying serum. And my skin doesn't typically need any clarification. <laughs> this breaks me out. It doesn't irritate my eczema, but it breaks me out. I'm not sure if you can tell because I used one of the products I'm going to talk about today on my face. I've got one, two, three... Or there's another one budding right there. That's like five or six different pimples on my face. And that might not sound like a lot, but for someone who rarely gets one or two, because of how my skin is and because of how dry it tends to be, and it's only ever done it since I've used this, I don't think my skin likes it no idea how much it costs either because my dad's wife gave it to me as a gift for free um because she didn't use it so i'm i mean i'm assuming based on the component it comes in and the fact that it's french that it's probably on the more expensive side which even then there are so many better things that are way more affordable at cvs than this into the next product. This is also from French Girl. It is the Rome Rose Creme Lumiere Creme 
Luxueuse pour le visage. It is a face cream. And, um... It smells... Exactly the same, if not stronger, as the serum that we just talked about. And I have been using these in conjunction with my skincare routine. And since then, face has been breaking out, too dry, headaches from how fragrance this is. And last but certainly not least, because this is the one I like, I am going to be talking about the Alba Botanica Acne Dote pimple patches. Can you see that? There we go. Now, I've never used a pimple patch before I bought these. And because I've never had need of them until I started using these. So, I love it. I have, let's bring you closer. Can you see that one? Two, sorry for bringing you so close to my face. Three, I think it's just three. Yeah, I have three on today. I had two here like yesterday or the day before that, not too long ago. And they work so well. These don't irritate my skin. I have a hard time finding things that are, you know, get rid of acne that don't completely dry out my skin and irritate my skin. And this doesn't do that. This is great. And you guys, this comes with 40 different little patches. It comes with big ones and it comes with small ones. And it really helps. It really does. It won't completely get rid of a pimple, but man, does it speed up the process of it going down. At Target, if I remember correctly, it was seven bucks. It was a steal. It works great for my eczema skin, which is sensitive all the time. So try it out if you want. I would definitely recommend it. All right, you guys, that's it from me. Before I forget, please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click that little notification bell if you would like a notification for when I upload a video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this helped you. I know this was really quick. I'm sorry. Um, but I hope you all just have a wonderful day. Bye.